Hey friends, today we are back at it again with another Sims 4 video, and this is the Burroughs family. And I decided that I wanted to start a legacy family, so this is who I decided to create and do it with. Also, this is a house that I built, and as you can see, it's very lackluster. There's not a lot of furnishing done. Um, the house itself, I personally think is beautiful, but call me biased because, I mean, I built it. Um, we're in the horse ranch town. Um, I can't remember what it's called right now. But uh, I decided that I had not actually ever really played a legacy or gone through trying to create a legacy in The Sims. I always just play with a family, get bored, restart, play with a family, get bored, restart. So I am going to challenge myself to actually create a legacy family. And with doing that, I will introduce you to our Sims. So this here is Chase Burroughs. He is active, good, family oriented, a maker, domestic, and would be happy to have a child. And then we have Sadie, who is clumsy, a bookworm, family oriented, would be happy to have a child, domestic, and pregnant. She is already pregnant in her second trimester, and that is because I actually created this family a while ago, and I recorded, or thought I had recorded, a video with them, and something happened, and it just wasn't working out. So, yeah. But, um... If he, uh, Sadie is going to be a stay-at-home mom while Chase is a working parent. He is in the gardening career and so we have this nice greenhouse where he can always have plants to harvest and work with. But yeah, so let's get started. Let's jump on in. We're going to have him be set to work hard. Sadie is going to, I guess, sit and watch a blank television. That that sounds fun. Um, I think we could find some better things to do than, than sit and watch the blank screen, but you know. Okay, now she's finally like actually watching TV. And instead of eating, she's just going to read. She is a bookworm, so I guess that kind of makes sense. eat the fish tacos. I do think once they actually make some money, I want to start getting kind of like farm animals. So maybe some mini goats or mini sheep, something of that nature. Uh, maybe chickens. I'm not sure if I really want to do chickens just yet, but maybe chickens. Um, but I do want to kind of get into doing that kind of stuff of having them be little farmers. So. All right, Sadie, how about we get dressed and then we'll go out for the day. We'll go out and do something. What trimester did you, I say she's still in her second, second trimester, but she has, her bump has gotten quite big. I decided to check out the Celebration Center in San Sequoia because I've, I don't think I've ever actually like really checked it out. So it's not looking too great. <laughs> Oh, but there are easels, so I think I want to have her do some painting and then see if she can kind of help with our household funds with painting. Because painting can be very lucrative once your sim actually gains some good skills in painting. So I think I want to do that and kind of help out with funding our little farm that I kind of want to create, but still I'm unsure if I'm going to create it. Okay, well, we took a loss on that painting. Can you stop? Sell your painting? Okay, do another figure painting. Okay, 
Okay, she's at level two, so hopefully, hopefully her painting will be a little bit better quality and she'll be able to sell it for at least a profit. That would be nice. Oh, Chase brought home 140 simoleons. We'll finish up this painting and then see what he has to get done for his daily tasks. I'm sure it's, yeah, harvest is harvestables and reach gardening skill level two. Miss ma'am, sell, sell that painting. We actually made a profit on that one, so that's, that's good. Okay, go ahead and use the bathroom. She's getting getting to the point where she's going to wet herself, so we'll, we'll get that done. Get our hands washed and we'll head home. Oh, somebody made food. Maybe I should have her just eat here instead. Where is everybody going? It's like everybody decided to leave all at the same time. Okay. So we can grab some leftovers. He actually fed himself, so that's great. Go harvest all of your plants. Oh, and then we can water them as well, and that should help us get to level two. He's so close. I hope he gets there. Yes. Okay, so he has done everything in theory that he needs to do to have a promotion or get a promotion so that is good what are you doing it says chat with chase but you're over here with the plant so i don't know i don't know girl i don't know but she can also harvest all the prairie grass because when you harvest the prairie grass sometimes you find stuff in the prairie grass and we could possibly sell that to help us with our finances sadie has learned about prairie grass hey okay oh we found some horse manure that'll be good to give to uh our husband so he can oh a bottle of grape nectar so that's great we can just pop that out here give it to him and soon i don't maybe he can already i'm not sure no level three so we can just kind of collect collect the uh, fertilizer that we find until he's actually able to use it to uh fertilize all the plants how rude she was watching that too pretty tasty still upset yeah, he did something to upset her, and I don't know what he did. <laughs> Sometimes Sadie can barely think straight when she's around a sim who has caused her pain. Sadie feels wrong by Chase, and being around Chase will remind Sadie of that pain. But I don't, I don't know what they, uh what he did to upset her because he hasn't cheated he hasn't he hasn't done anything of that sort so i really i really don't know i don't know why she's upset with him or what he did okay that's it to harvest oh i didn't want to go all the way back to him he can come back home all right, he can go to sleep and get ready for work tomorrow. And I'm also going to have him empty out his inventory into the uh, fridge. Oops. Why is there a teen just showing up at my house? I think that's a little strange. I think I want to get a skill book. I want her to be good with cooking. We can do the baking book and cooking level one. We'll do both of those and then have her 
we'll start with cooking. We'll have her start reading the cooking book so she can kind of start gaining her skill. Her Okay, or not. She just said, screw that. And now she's reading the gardening book. So how fun is that? And you couldn't do it out here while your husband's trying to sleep. You know, he has work tomorrow. My dog wants out of my bedroom, but if I let him out of my bedroom, he cannot be trusted to be out in the living room area by himself. So he's kind of like whining to want to get out of the bedroom. Okay, how about we use the bathroom before we go to sleep? All right, go ahead and get yourself some leftovers. Fish tacos for breakfast. How delicious. There's actually a YouTuber that I watch and she talks about like fitness and eating healthy and whatnot and gives tips and tricks and whatnot to that. And she does not eat like the conven conventional breakfasts because they're not filling to her. So she eats stuff that's like more so dinner or lunch related for breakfast. And I actually think it's a really cool concept to, to actually eat stuff that's filling instead of just eating what we've been kind of taught that is breakfast food. Oh, mood swing. All right, Chase is off to work. You need to clean up after yourself, ma'am. I know you're pregnant, but we want to keep this house tidy. We're going to have him work hard. Oh, you're going to cry it out. Have yourself a good little cry. That's okay. You can do that. Oh, you're already hungry again. Let's, let's serve breakfast. Let's actually, let's make some fruit salad. So you can have something other than fish tacos. All right, cooking level three, awesome. Now pop that there in the fridge. I should get one of the decoration, season decoration totes. I always forget about that. So I got one of the little totes, just popped it in right there. And then she is, I think, very pregnant. She'll give birth whenever she feels like it today. But I think we might... Oh, no, we're going to leave that to your husband. We're going to have her go work on painting again. We'll try this one now, this side. Just do a sad painting. You're going to be sad for two more hours, so... Hopefully it'll be good quality and hopefully it'll help you work out those sad feelings you're feeling. I mean, it's looking great. <laughs> that painting is looking so good. It did help her get out of her funk though. She's not sad anymore. Stop chatting though. I know you want to make friends. It's yes, you like painting because that's going to help us out. That is Yep, I could see that being a poor quality painting. That's, it wasn't really that great. Why is there a bathtub in here? Is this the only bathroom on this lot? Because, oh, there we go. I say, girl's got to use the bathroom. She's, she's pretty heavily pregnant. She's got to go. She's got to go. Okay, people. I do like how this lot has, like, family bathrooms. I think that's really cute. Okay, do another figure painting. Oh, okay, Chase got promoted. Chase has been promoted to a soil sifter. Awesome. He will now make an additional dollar per hour for a grand total of $21 per hour. He has also received the following bonus, 300 simoleons and starter herbs. Awesome. And this looks like a pretty decent quality painting that she's doing. So hopefully it actually sells for a decent amount of simoleons. Hey, there we go. Making, making more of a profit. Now we can head home to see hubby. All right. He's dazed from 
his mental load. Um, my guy, you've only worked like a few days, so maybe stop it. <laughs> maybe, maybe stop it. Like psych yourself up. Maybe don't be that way because kind of need you to uh, tend the garden and whatnot. Um, hopefully he can still harvest these without having an issue. I'm hoping that I'm not going to have the weed glitch. Looks like I am awesome. Where he's weeding the plants and it just doesn't matter. The weeds are still there. And now he's just stuck in a loop of weeding the plants. Okay, well, stop weeding because, I mean, we're probably going to end up losing those plants, unfortunately. Oh, what are they? Our tomato bush and our bell pepper bush. Awesome. That is so frustrating. I thought that they had fixed the weed glitch, but I guess not. And go ahead and watch the current movie. Yeah, he has work tomorrow, but I think I'm going to have him use his family <laughs> shushing him during the movie. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm going to have him start his family leave tomorrow so he can hopefully get rid of this mental fog. Because I don't want him to get burnt out with his job and then want to like change jobs. I want him to, I want him to have a thriving career as a gardener. All right, miss ma'am. No, no. How about we use the bathroom first? And then you can sleep because I'm sure you're going to be going into labor soon. All right, take family leave and then sleep. Okay, we're going to have her go ahead and decorate for Harvest Fest. Oh, look at those decorations. How cute. And then I think I'm going to have her start cooking a grand meal because she's going to love cooking the grand meal and doing all those fun things. So we'll do the turkey dinner and then Chase. Okay, never mind. She's gone into labor. Um, <laughs> so maybe she'll, well, I don't plan on having her have her baby at the uh, hospital. So we're just going to have her kind of have to, I guess, tough it out until her baby pops out. Um, we'll have him appease the gnomes. Okay, so this one, oh, it just moved. This one is salad. This one, I believe, is a toy. No, I think it's a pie. And then this one is coffee. As long as I've been playing this game, I totally did not realize this was a female gnome and actually has like boobs on it. I just noticed that today. <laughs> oh. Yep, finish cooking your grand meal and then totally maybe pop out your baby. Maybe I'll send her to the doctor, to the hospital herself. We're going to hit call to grand meal because then that should tick off. Right, they'll eat and then should tick that off. I'm going to pop that in the fridge. You need to desperately use the bathroom, so. Oh, hey, since there's a baby on the way, Sim Social Services has provided a bassinet. Cause I was too cheap to buy one. I wasn't, wasn't going to buy it. <laughs> All right. This baby girl, um, let's name her Haley.
Oh, she had a bladder failure. That's that's totally fine. Yeah. Go go take a shower. We're going to have you go ahead and feed baby Haley. How did you have a negative interaction with your child while trying to feed her? Um, sir. All right, you also need to use the bathroom. We'll have you get that done. Okay, are you done? We can mop this up, clean this up. Is the gnome in your way? We'll just pop that guy right there. There we go. What? Okay, baby Haley, you need to go right there. All right, clean that up, wash your hands, and then finish your turkey. You can send a thank you card to Juniper. Okay, you can go ahead and clean that up. And then you can send a thank you card to Umber. All right, and we should be good for Harvest Fest. And I'm gonna, are you kidding me? Why, why is this broken? Sir, repair that, thank you. I'm gonna pick up all these seed packets. This is the one thing I really love about Harvest Fest is you get a bunch of seed packets and if you're working on trying to start like a good healthy garden, you get a bunch of free seed packets. It's great. Okay, we're gonna empty out his inventory. All right, our baby has woken up. So mom can now actually interact with her little baby Haley. Oh, thanks. She's perfect. The most beautiful little girl. Mm -hmm. Sir, you could totally mop that up. You, you could have done that. Oh, he's feeling dizzy. Oh, that's not good. Oh, baby's crying. We need to figure out how to order medicine without a computer. Okay, so I Googled it and it looks like we have to actually order it from a computer. So we're just going to head over to a library. I know there's one in Willow Creek. Hopefully they have computers. I can't remember if this one has computers or not. Uh, yes, computers. And then we will, I don't want to set the table. I just want to order some medicine. Order medicine. We're going to get five. All right, nope, we're not going to be playing video games. We're going to be heading home. It's a holiday. We need to be home with our family. Plus, your husband needs medicine. He's sick. Okay. Oh, did he? Okay, he was taking care of the baby when we left. Not taking care of little Haley now. We're going to breastfeed her. We're also going to just pop that there. And you, sir, can take some medicine. All right, what's nice is his mental fog is gone, so we can start opening some of these seed packets and see what we don't have and plant them. Oh, hey. The gnomes are out here in our little garden. 
Maybe we'll try to weed again, hopefully. Okay, none of them. I mean, what's great about this glitch is his gardening level is going up, but we're definitely going to be losing plants because we can't tend to our garden correctly. Bess, I don't want to talk to you. It's a holiday. Take a break from the scams, okay? Harvest all. And I want to start opening oh, some more tomatoes, some more mushrooms. Do we already have parsley? Yep, parsley, basil. Taro root is something we don't have planted, so we can pop that down. We already have basil. I don't think I'm gonna do the, I'm not gonna worry too much about the flowers in the uh, greenhouse. And now this is where I want to see if they'll be able to still get to these plants with these ones being in front of them. I'm hoping they can, but we will see right now because of the weed glitch. Okay, awesome. Water all the plants. And then I'm gonna pop our pear tree right there. You can plant the pear tree. I wonder if I reset this and maybe if I reset all of them. Can I weeds mulched? Okay. At least I can do that where we won't be losing our plants. So I'll still have him weed them and then hopefully remember to go in and mulch them after he's done. Because I really, really don't want to lose them. And if he's doing the work, then I don't feel bad for cheating to have them cleaned up. Throw that diaper away. Why are you, why'd you just leave it on the floor? Probably because they don't have a uh, trash can in their house. That is my bad, but still. Okay, tomatoes, basil, parsley, pears, green peas, onions, green beans, potatoes. I believe I have potato plants. Do I? That's the taro. Oh, wait, I already had taro root. So I didn't need that one. So we'll just uproot that one and we'll plant a potato there instead. And then we will continue putting away our produce. I need to plant the spinach as well. Okay, we already sprayed for bugs, but I guess we'll we'll do that again. Yep, I would hope you like gardening because you're not getting out of it. It is your job, sir. And then you you're doing okay. You I want to open the packets of seeds we just got. We got some carrots and grapes. Okay. I say stay right there in the, the greenhouse because we're going to be planting. Okay, or walk away. I'm just going to have you come back, sir. Because you need to plant these. Oh, now you can walk around the gnome? You couldn't do it in the bathroom, but you could do it right there? Okay. All right, I'm going to let you come in and use the bathroom and get some leftovers because you are hungry. 
and I'm gonna end harvest day. I am enjoying the free seed packets that we got, but he could use a break and I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna sell the gnomes. You can always get a decent amount of simoleons for selling the gnomes. We'll get whatever else put up. Okay, we have a lot of flowers. I am going to plant the flowers, but I'm gonna plant them outside. I just haven't figured out where I want to have, maybe I'll have them over here, have like a little flower garden over here. I don't know, I'm trying to figure out the best place for it and where exactly I want it. Especially because they can't be like put together and move objects like the actual plants that don't do anything. So I just want to have a nice little flower garden, I guess, somewhere, mainly because you can make a decent amount of money selling the flowers. Oh, baby's crying. And I say, you go back to sleep. She can change diaper. I don't think the diaper is the issue. I think your baby might be hungry. Oh, not more choices. Go to sleep. Okay, that was not meant to just be set down there, sir. Okay, now she has a dirty diaper. So go ahead and change her dirty diaper. You just try to go back to sleep and you throw those away. And I should probably buy an actual trash can for inside. Oh, he's off work today. I totally was trying to get him prepared to go to work today, but don't have to do that. <laughs> All right, well, awesome. We can have him just kind of tend the garden and work on his gardening skill. We can figure out, maybe I'll just have the rose and, well, rose, the flower garden over here on this side, and then I'll keep like the fruit trees over here. I think I might do that. Okay, so we got that taken care of. Hopefully all of our plants in side we're in the greenhouse we're taking care of all right and then when it comes to all of these I'm just gonna go ahead and sell them all right and his needs are not too bad baby's okay he can go and interact with her for a little bit we'll take down our harvest fest decorations oh she's gonna take a nap why don't you just go sleep in your bed and then you can clean up. I also want to know if she has a high enough skill to can and if we're able to... Okay, we can start canning some stuff. But we don't have a lot of fruits. We have mainly vegetables, so... Alright, so I think I'm going to leave this video here. He already got a promotion. And then we had little baby Haley, little cutie. Sadie's doing pretty good postpartum. She's not doing too bad, which is great. And yeah, I think this is a good place, good good stopping point for, for the start of this legacy, this start of this let's play. I don't know. Um, I don't know if this is going to turn into an actual like little series on my channel or what but let me know how you guys like it I kind of just wanted to play the game without any challenges and without stressing myself out over it I kind of just miss playing for the most part so thank you for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe I appreciate when you do that and I'll see you in the next one bye